Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum everyone. In this video tutorial, we are going to learn a new instruction of 8086 microprocessor and that is ADC. ADC stands for aid with carry, right? Uh, the, uh, the format of this instruction is ADC is a keyword, D is a destination operand, comma, S is a source operand. And what will be the operation? Destination plus source plus carry. So carry is a carry flag, which is present in the status register or flag register of 8086 microprocessor. So we are not going to not only add destination plus source, but rather carry will be also added. We're going to see an example in emulator environment. Let's go to this uh, program. Okay, we will write some instruction in the program. Uh, let's say move uh, BL comma or BX is equal to uh, one, two, three, four hertz. And we want to perform certain addition so that we have a carry flag because we want to test this carry, right? So we will add some value, let's say move, or we will add some immediate value, add B X comma F four zero. So we will have a carry, I will show you, uh, or I can just, uh, okay, I will show you in the emulator. Then uh, what we will do, we will perform some uh, ADC function. So let's say we write, uh, uh, we have a value in CX, CX is around 4502 hex, okay, and now we're gonna add, okay, since we have, we are using F in the start, we have to place a zero prefix because we cannot put uh, alphabetic numbers, right, directly, we have to put some numbers before and that is why we place zero here, okay, now everything is okay, now we will perform ADC instruction, uh, VX comma CX, right. Uh, I hope this time maybe you are confused in this code, but we will execute this instruction line by line. So this code will become much more clear and this function, uh, the function of this instruction will also be clear, right? So let's emulate this code. Okay, the first line shown in the yellow color in the source code over here, I hope you can see that is BX comma 1234. So 1234 will be loaded in the BX register. Let's run it. Uh, 1234 is loaded in the BX register. I hope you can see that. The next thing what we are doing, BX comma 050F450 to be added because add instruction is used and add instruction is used as an immediate mode, right? Because immediate number F450 is added, right? If we add uh, 1234, I'm just adding manually so that everybody understand 450. In So what will be the result? Result would be what? Let me do it 404, four, then 3 plus 5, it would be 8, right? Uh, 2 plus 4, it would be 6, okay? And 1F, F is what? 15. 15 plus 1 would be 16, and in, six, in six, 16, in hexadecimal, it becomes 10, right? So this is how uh, this number results in 17 bit because these are what? 8 bit 16 bit data in hexadecimal but this one is extra and that will go in flag register so let's open the flag register this is our flag register right and carry flag currently zero if i'm gonna add this instruction as this is the new uh, or next instruction to be executed in yellow what is going to happen there will be a carry flag right and which will be indicated in this flag so let's run it so 0684 as i told you this least significant 16 bit number is shown in BX and the carry flag is high. I hope you can see that over here. Let me arrange it. I hope you can see that carry flag is high. So carry is currently have some certain value. Okay. The next instruction, what we are doing, move CX comma 4502 and that will be loaded in CX. So let's run it. 4502 is loaded. Now what we are performing, we are adding BX with CX and we will also include this one. That is why uh, this carry flag will become important, right? So let's run it. 4B87. Why it came through like that? Let me show you. The BX value was 0684, okay? And CX value was 4502. If we add them up, what will be result? It will be what? It will be 6, 8, 6 plus 5, 11 would be 11 means, means uh, B and 4 will remain 4. But 
why this 4b 87 is shown because c is also included or carry is also added the last in last operation carry flag was 1 and 1 if added it will become 7 or if i uh, show carry separately uh, let me do it in the downwards if you perform one more addition right so there was a plus sign result was like that and then we have a plus again over here so it will become uh what uh, let me correct it the result would be what 4b87 i hope you have understand the concept of adc it is used when we are adding three numbers or when we are adding to 16 uh, to uh, three 16 bit numbers then we may have a carry in between and that should be included in the result that is why this is uh, adc this in adc instruction is used i hope this instruction is clear still if you have any confusion or query you can post your queries in comment section thank you so much for listening